Hey guys, New Yorker Scythe here, and um, I'm sorry for the short pause. Um, I'm not like upset or anything right now, but there's something I have to tell you. So, in case you don't know, there's this guy on YouTube named Michael Ruffins. Now, uh, now, what is my opinion on Michael Ruffins? You ask. Michael Ruffins. Well, he is a great great user i mean i can't lie to you he's he is a great user he makes this series called rain rainbow riddles inspired of my favorite and i'm pretty sure it's your favorite childhood show blues clues and believe it or not guys blues clues is my all-time number one favorite childhood nick jr show i'm sure i liked other nick jr shows too like like Little Bear, Gullah Gullah Island, and Franklin, and um, and Kipper, and other shows that premiered on Nick Jr. But I, but Blues Clues, but Blues Clues rather, yeah, but Blues Clues is will all is and always will be my all-time number one favorite childhood show regardless if the show is on or not and even and, even, and I, I also love blues clues and you <clears throat> sorry if i if my voice cracked and everything <sighs> but anyways <sighs> going back about the youtuber michael ruffins now michael if you're watching this now i'm not here to say anything negative about you i I, 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 I like you and everything. I mean, I like your channel, and I like your series, Rainbow's Riddles. Okay, getting to that. A lot of people seem to dislike Rainbow's Riddles. I mean, sure, not everybody has to like, like the shows you like. I mean, it's their opinion. You have to respect that. If they don't like the show, they don't like the show. You don't have to go all acting like a... Like a like a five year old saying, "How can you not like it? I like it and whatnot." We all have our own opinions, and, and surely there are some things that you don't like that maybe they like, so they know how you feel, and you know how they feel. But anyways, I want to tell you about Rainbow's Riddles. These people who don't like Rainbow's Riddles. They say it's a ripoff of Blue's Clues. But is it a ripoff of Blue's Clues? No, it's not a ripoff of Blue's Clues. It was inspired by Blue's Clues. Sorry if my voice is cracking or if I keep changing my tones, but you know, I need, I just need to get this off my chest. A lot of people don't seem to understand the differences between ripoffs and inspirations. Now, to these people who are saying that Rainbow's Riddles is a ripoff of Blue's Clues, I honestly do not know why you say that it's a ripoff of Blue's Clues, in your opinion. It's not like if Michael is using the characters like like Steve or Joe or Josh or Blue or Tickety Talk or... The Felt Friends are Side Table Drawer, Mr. Salt, Mrs. Pepper, Shovel, Pale, Paprika, Cinnamon, Sage, Ginger, Mailbox, Slippery Soap, um, and all the other characters on the show. Like, I, I don't understand at all. How, how is Rainbow's Riddles a ripoff? How is it? And and to Aiden McCartney, a.k.a. Change Dragon, if you're watching this, I, please do not make any response videos to this or, or you're using like dragons or ninjas or whatever, you, or whatever characters you use in your videos. I mean... Don't get me wrong. I like Rainbow's Riddles too. I like it myself. Oh, if you know. So yeah, Mike, and also Michael, if you're watching this, I'm really sorry you had to go through a lot of people who are saying, "Oh, 
oh, Rainbow's Riddles is a, is a ripoff of Blue's Clues and whatnot. Uh, I, I'm really sorry you had to go through that. I mean, come on. I know it's your opinion and everything. You guys can dislike the show all you want, but saying that it's a ripoff of Blue's Clues will not will not solve any better. Now I know you're so, and you're probably saying, "Oh, so you don't, so you don't give an expletive if if it's a, if it's a ripoff or not, huh?" Well, basically, yeah. I well, well, basically. Well, basically, yeah. I honestly, I honestly don't don't care whether if if you if you say it's a ripoff or not. And I know, oh, you guys who subscribe to who subscribe to my channel, I know you're probably saying, so you're disrespecting or bashing their opinion on Rainbow's Riddles. Wow, I thought you were a great user, but since you bashed their opinions on Rainbow's Riddles, I'm cutting ties with you. And I'm making opinion change videos out of you, whether if you like it or not. You know? Alright, so... Okay. Look, I'm sorry... Free... Free... That you would have to hear me say that I wouldn't care whether if Rainbow's Riddles is a ripoff or not, you know? But in my opinion, in my opinion, Rainbow's Riddles is not a ripoff of Blue's Clues, like Michael said. It was inspired by the show. Now, now, how, now suppose I made a show inspired by Blue's Clues too. Or, and Blue's Clues and you. I, I can't forget about that, yeah. And you guys say, oh, that's a ripoff, that's a ripoff, that's a ripoff. Uh, I'm I'm not going to care. Or, I mean, sure, you have your rights to say what if you like it or not. Sure, this is a free country, and, and I mean, this country is free. And, and Canada is a free country, too, even though I'm not from Canada. I'm from the United States. And, of course, as Spongebob would say to Gary in the episode Gary Takes a Bath, it may be a free country, but you live in my house under my rules, even though you guys don't live with me at my house. Yeah. But anyways, guys, long story short, our... Rainbow's Riddles is not a ripoff of Blue's Clues. It was inspired. You guys don't really understand the differences between ripoffs and inspirations. So yeah. So, and also, Michael, if you're watching this, once again, I'm sorry you had to go through that. I hope I don't go through the same thing you're going through. So yeah. Okay, guys, that's all I would like to say for now. This is New Yorker Science signing off. Don't forget to rate, subscribe, comment.